This is playing Anne speaking, and welcome to my brand new Let's Play of Resident Evil 2, the remake. I've been waiting a long time for this uh, for this remake to come out. A couple, in the very least, I have waited for this game to come out ever since I played the the uh, first uh, Resident Resident Evil remake, and I thought that was a really really nice game, really good game, and so I ha I have been anxiously waiting for this one. Let's just jump right into it and yeah, let's go for story mode new game and uh, just like the original game we can we can uh, choose between Leon or Claire and just because I played as Jill in the last game I may actually use use sorry <laughs> I may actually choose Claire just because I'm a woman, she's a woman. That's my reasoning and I'm sticking to it. I'm going to choose Claire. Claire Ritfield. A different nightmare awaits Claire Ritfield, who is unaware of just how drastically her very ordinary life is about to change. <laughs> yeah, because that's going to be a random zombie apocalypse <laughs> that she's going to get into. Okay. So Assisted standard standard hardcore. I'm going for standard. Raccoon City, an industrial city in the heart of America. And Claire, okay, never mind. I'm not going to read that. Look, man, I'm serious. Okay, I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay. Well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse. Like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, it'll sink to the teeth of them. Oh, come on. It's just getting good. I really like that uh, <laughs> that very close up close up of that burger that he was eating in the beginning of this uh, in this introduction in, in this introduction scene. <laughs> yeah, definitely remember remember this from the original game. The truck. I've played some of the original game for the PlayStation One. And Jesus Christ, I think I was 13, 14 when I first played it, and it was so creepy. She is Claire Ritfield. Yeah, I'm almost there. You know me, I'll be fine. Sounds good. I'll be back as soon as I find Chris. I will, but I gotta go. Why does everyone think I'm gonna get in trouble? I really like these cinematics. Well, oh, I think I. Oh, explore your surroundings. This is definitely new. I remember that the uh, Resident Evil 2, the original game, had the had those really, really odd camera angles that the Resident Evil 1 and 3 also had, and. Uh, I kind of wish they would have stuck with the uh, odd camera angles because that really added a lot to the atmosphere and uh, not knowing what's around the corner, you know? Do, 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 do. 
to do. Guess this is Leon's car. He was a, a newbie cop, wasn't he? That's his backstory. Oh, hamburgers! You can get a hamburger like the tr like the truck dude had. Hello. Anybody here? Hello. I already I already don't like this. <laughs> I don't know whether or not I can shoot. Yeah, she has a gun, but I don't think she's. Uh... Yeah, okay. If are you okay? If I was th this r little girl in this scenario, scenario. Wait here. I'll check it out. I would definitely just pull out my gun immediately, especially after lo looking at that guy. You know. Seriously, this game is really impressive. I mean, it, I know it's a standard for AAA games nowadays, but but really, compared to the original original uh, Resident Evil 2 game, this is really nice. Look at all this stuff. There has been some CG artists who really had a <laughs> had a boring job making all these cans and all these uh, small things. Okay. Did he run? Wait! Hey, what the hell? Dude, he locked us in here! Actually, I can't remember if that happened in the original game. Okay, let's see. First Zane B encounter. No, you don't. Yum. <laughs> oh, that's creepy. <laughs> okay, aim for the head. Shit. That was a head. Come on. And okay, yeah. There was definitely also a feature in the uh, in the original game. It take, took several shots to uh, put down a uh, a zombie. Come on, are there any more of them? Oh, there's a key. Oh wow, I like that the item kind of pops up at us at the screen. That is really reminiscent of the original game. And uh, oh, and I can shoot where it goes. Well, one key. Tip. Oh, look at that! Our health bar. I really like that. That's okay, so tab is in is inventory. Can I read that? Can I read that? Oh, if I if I if I were you, Claire, I would definitely eat that pizza. But I don't have that option in the game. Hmm. Oh, look at that. Aren't they pretty? Okay. So, let's see if the classic uh, guy... No way. Can't be alive. Ah, I fucking missed. Fuck. Damn it. Reload! I don't have any more bullets! Fuck. 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 No! no. <laughs> Fuck. No! Maybe I should have missed. Run. <laughs> Maybe I should have missed him so many times. <laughs> How do I use it? How is my health bar still saying fine? Like honestly? Okay, how do I use it? How do I use the key? <laughs> huh. 
How do I use it? I have a feeling that I'm going to die in this first section of the game just because I missed uh, the zombies so many times. <laughs> oh shit. He's gonna come in just a moment. Oh, hello there. Yeah. But I don't... I'm probably missing some th something. Missing how I am... Oh, there's a door right there all <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. We need to use an item to unlock a door or solve a puzzle. We select the item and then the blah blah use command. There we are. Let's get out of here. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck you. Yeah, I definitely missed something. Yeah, it is, Jill. Oh, fuck. Jesus Christ, get out, Jill! Jill! There he is. There he is. We gotta get out of here. You alright? You get munched on. I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later. When we're safe. Pretty shit. You don't have any more bullets, Claire. Perfect. Come on. Get in. Hold on. Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. You live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop, too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. I really like the logic of these games. Boom! Zombie apocalypse. That was a good opening, in my opinion, anyway. I really like this. I'm excited to play the rest of it. I never actually finished the original, uh, the original game, just because I was so uh, liberal with my bullets. It was only when I, when I was at the police station I've gotten the, and I have solved a good chunk of the puzzles that I realized that uh, I should probably have, you know preserved my bullets and uh, only uh, take the shots when when it is actually needed and just uh, don't shoot if I can run, run away instead. Resident Evil 2. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. You'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Like we're walking from here. Mm, yum. More like running. Yeah, good call. Ooh, fuck! Ah, oh, the jump scare. Oh, 
<laughs> oh, is it the truck? Holy shit. There, get out. Get out now! Ah, oh, shit. Hold on! Seriously, that was so epic in the original game. And uh, there it is. We got separated from Leon. I'm pretty sure she wouldn't be standing up so soon afterwards, af after such an explosion. And if I remember correctly, there are going to be four zombies uh, going at Claire. us immediately. Claire, are you okay? Yeah. Safe. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's going to be zombies, and we got to run. Ah, oh, shit! And I'm just going to to run, dash for it. Don't worry, Claire. I'm not going to stop. Where am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to go in here? I'm just I'm just going to try to go in here. Why are you so slow, Claire? Do we even have any bullets? No, I don't have any bullets. I'm completely out of bullets. Dear Claire, first of all, thanks for the letter. Now, if you'll let me get this one thing off my chest. I can't believe you're really gonna do it. I can't believe you're biking all the way to Raccoon City all by yourself. Just to see your brother? How dare she go to go see her brother? What the hell, girl? I know Chris means a lot to you, and yeah, you haven't been able to reach him for a month and all, but you're nuts. You know how many perverts and assholes are out there, just waiting for a hot young college student to come along and take and take advantage of? It's not safe to travel alone, so she needs a sword. But your ma your but your mind's made up, isn't it? Fine. I get it. Just promise you'll call when you get to Raccoon City. Don't leave your bestest best friend hanging, okay? Love ya. Right. The police station. Almost there. I wish I had bullets. I'm just gonna run past you, thank you. I'm going, just going to run past all of you. Fuck, 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 fuck. Perfect. Okay, okay. Okay, now that they are out there, I guess we can explore a little. Nothing over there. There are body bags everywhere. RPD Raccoon City. Let's get in. I need more bullets. Is there going to be a jump scare? Great. Ah shit! No, I didn't. I don't. I do not want to go in there. Where are you? I just wanted to take a look, honestly. Yeah, I'm going to uh, leave this place immediately. No. Ah shit. Five shot capacity, nine millimeter handgun. No. What do we do? Ah, okay.
Okay. Fuck. I uh, locked myself in. I know I'm be playing for a short while. Yay me! Go me! <laughs> uh, I need bullets. I should have explored the main area before going in here. And I'm quite certain I'm going to die. <laughs> Fuck! Uh. <sighs> I really hope I find some bullets soon. I need them. Oh, come on. Come on! <laughs> Oh sh I'm completely defenseless. <laughs> Looks like there have been, been been people camping in here at some point. Makes you wonder where they all went. Focus Claire. Focus. Okay. This is not nice. I do not like this. And I want bullets! <laughs> okay. Okay. Ah. Uh. Right. Okay, there were bodies over there, and uh, since th this uh, since this is Resident Evil, they're bound to stand up and uh, do stuff, you know, like zombies do. So I'm not going to go over there. Wow, I do not like this. I don't want to do this. I just want to find some bullets. You know, I really, really should have stayed in the main area before going off like this. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Fuck you. So that corpse is most likely going to stand up when I approach it. Uh, and I have absolutely no way of defending myself. And somehow my health is just fine again. Really use some bullets. Anything? Anything I can pick up? This game is really atmospheric. Does that guy have bullets on him? Or is he just going to stand up and bite me? Yeah, there's really no reason to point this thing at anyone. Oh, thank god! Thank you! Okay, wait. Okay. Okay, there we are. Perfect. I feel a lot more confident right right about now. Okay, let's have a look around. We only got ten bullets, but it's, that's enough for now until we find something new. Okay. 
okay, he didn't stand up. That's uh, one thing that's good. One thing that's wonderful and amazing. Okay, we still need a thing to get out. So what is it we need again? To open that door over there. Oh, can I sneak out? No. No, I cannot. Yeah, I still need the other fuse. Right. Okay, I'm just gonna... <laughs> nope, I cannot do that. Okay. Oh, I wish the atmospheric music just would stop. Okay, let's have a look at the, where the dead bodies are. Where there will eventually be a dead body rising up again. And try to scare me and spook me and all that. Let's get it over with. Why am I playing this game again? Ugh. Okay. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, I know, Claire. I heard someone. I don't suppose I can use this? No. No, I cannot. I can hear someone. Okay, let's beat through Open here. Up. Hurry! Open up! Open this goddamn door! Okay. I'm here! Open the door! Huh? Hurry up! Hurry up! Uh, Open it! Uh, here, give me your hand! Help me! Uh, and I guess me. Hold on! Uh, give me your give me your other hand! Ah uh, oh, shit! Oh shit! <laughs> I'm so sorry. Yum. Officer's notebook. Got a statue. Parking way out. All oh, right, it's oh, oh, I think it's going to be the same uh, logical as logic from the uh, first Resident Evil game. There's going to be some puzzles, and they're not going to make any sense, no sense at all. <laughs> it's hilarious, really. Oh fuck! Ah oh, fuck! I'm still not sure how to uh, get out of here. I don't have the thing that I'm supposed to have. And reload. Thank god they are slow. And come on. God, I hate the, hate the music. First day spray. <laughs> Down in the toilet. <laughs> yes. Oh, the music. I hate the music. I hate the music. I hate it. I should not have wasted my bullet on that same bee. I should not have wasted my bullet on the same bee. Yes, I want that. Is there anything else I can take? No. Okay, let's run. Fuck! Why? Why? Oh, 
Okay. What? What? Can it just get out? Why can't it just get out? Go out the window. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Okay. Fuck you. Right. Uh, yeah, fuck you. Num num. I'm still not sure how to get out of here. I'm pretty sure I'm going to die either way. Because yay me. What? You know what? Fuck you, Claire. Fuck. Okay, I, I'm doing exactly as I did in the uh, previous game and just wasting my bullets to left and right. Mm, yum. You all right? Yeah. You're safe. For now. <clears throat> Marvin Brana. Thanks. Obviously, someone taught you well. Yeah, I know how to take care of myself. Come on. <clears throat> so nobody knows what caused this? There's a lot of theories. But all I know for sure is that this place is crawling with zombies. Yeah, you're telling me. Hey, hey, keep that on. Just in case. I'm not gonna be around long. Once I find Chris, we're out of here. You really Chris's sister? Yeah. Why? Did you find something? He's on vacation. Europe, I think. Left weeks ago. <laughs> vacation? Well, good on Chris. That's... that's great news. Well, I've got more for you. Looks like there might be a way out through this secret passageway. Of course, there's a secret passageway on the station. Hey, <sighs> hey we should probably get you to the hospital. Oh, no, no, no. Forget about me. I can take care of myself. No, don't be ridiculous. You're gonna need some help. Listen, Claire. Save yourself. So you can see your brother again. Now, you probably need this. No, I'm not taking that. You're gonna... And be careful. If you see one of those things, no matter who they were, you can't hesitate. Take them out if you can. Or you run. Sweet. Got a compass knife. Nice. I only got one bullet left. And here we have the thing for the secret passage passageway in the <laughs> in the <laughs> in on the in the police station. There's an area over there that we have unlocked. Let's have a good look around, shall we? Oh, hello. 
and there were fucking bullets right there all along. <sighs> and the typewriter so we can save. Wait, so we don't don't we need the uh, actual items that we can save like uh, cases of ink? Oh never mind. Okay oh right. Here we have a magical box that will store all of our loot. <laughs> no matter which box we are going we are going to open there will be our loot. The same exact loot. <laughs> In our magical boxes. It really is magical. And we have loaded up, and I really shouldn't be so liberal liberal with my bullets anymore. I say that, but I probably will be liberal with my bullets anyway, so... Go me. Let's just have a look around before we go anywhere. This is really uh, Resident Evil 1 uh, stuff, where we are in a big mansion. Plus, plus E. Okay. Lion, Rose, Eagle. Can I do something here with that? Lion. And an Eagle. Hello! We got the lion medallion. Perfect. And then what? And for the woman, that's going to be woman, Aaron Snake. Oh, that's the first statue. Got it. So I have to find the statues first. Yes. That's the first one. So Elliot was right. Yeah, but we're not out of here yet. I'm going to yeah, I'm going to need the statues. And they're going to be in the each of that end of the station. Right, I'm go I'm going to put s some items in the in the box. Before I move on, I'm going to put the key in here. I'm going to put one of these in there. And now we have a bit more space for when we are out adventuring. Is there anything up here that I can take? No, I no, I don't think so. Let's move on. And here's a, a more bullet. Green herb! Ah! <laughs> I remember this from the first game. <laughs> I really like these green herbs. I like I like that the herbs are everywhere. <laughs> Just littered everywhere. And I can use them to heal myself. Oh, I think I remember this part. Slightly from the first game. Oh, right. Yeah, I do remember this part all vaguely. And it's really unpleasant. Especially the, especially the windows. Don't. Ah, oh, please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Yum! Why did you do that, Claire? That was not what I wanted you to do, Claire. Oh shit. Oh, hello there. He's going to stand up again, isn't he? And there's a symbol on the door. Perfect. I don't like this. I've never liked this. And I never will like this.
Fuck you. A record of events. September 25th. We are turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. September 25th. Ad addendum. Perfect. One of the ref refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was simply a case for someone snapping under intense stress. September 26th. A mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few, a few survivors, survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we are, It'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We are not sure we can fix any of our our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September 27th. There was another clash on the west side of the station around 1 p.m. Twelve people died, and there is only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray in here. David Ford. A map. The first floor, that's nice. Where am I? Um, I'm in the operations room. This is the records room and I don't want to go out in the hallway. <laughs> I'll just uh, stay out of there for now. Oh, oh. Okay, that's nice. Okay, these are the places I have already... Okay. Ah, oh, fuck you. Ah, oh, fuck you. Maybe I should have done that. But I'm not always the smartest cookie in the room, so... Well... What? Oh no, what? What is it? What did you, you can't just randomly say, oh no, Claire. Jesus Christ. Where are we? Okay, we're in there. There's something, someone shuffling around somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! Fuck. Can I stop his head? Oh, fuck you. There we are. Seriously though, fuck that guy. <laughs> yeah, where are we? Okay, that's locked. Oh my god. It's going to be... S he's going to... St is he going to stand up again? Gunpounder. Okay. Uses of gunpowder. Okay, so this is how we're going to make our own gunpowder. This is going to be important. For handgun, two p two gunpowder. For acid rounds, gunpowder plus high grade gunpowder. Right. 
and we simply make them by combining. Pretty sure that's not how it actually works, but you know. Fuck you. Really? Hmm, okay, so that's a save that I don't know the password for. Is that fucker over there going to stand up? I have a feeling that yes, because he's an asshole. Operation report. Simswinza, September 28th. 2.30 a.m. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not gonna make it. Officer Phillips once suggested, w suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret, tu secret tunnel under this place left over from its museum days. I brushed, I brushed her idea off before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof there's even a tunnel or that the sewers aren't infested with the zombies. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot. But I'm gonna try to find out what what I can what I can about the tunnel. Elliot Edward. Hmm. Good on you, Elliot. Okay, so we are on the other side of the information disk. It's nice. Oh, please. Get okay, Emily, let me reload because I need my bullets. Let's see here. Rookie's first assignment. Oh, it's Leon! We are putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Oh. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success, success is in the initials of our, of our first names. Input the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks. One in each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officer's name. But you figure that out that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. <sighs> Be glad you're not here, rookie. Fuck. Okay. Let's see, have a look at have a look at our notes. There's David Ford. There's Elliot Edward. The initials of our first names. Right, so we have a uh, an Elliot. We have a David and an Elliot. Right. I don't want to go past that guy for reasons. Just reasons. I don't think there's anything else I can pick up right now. Oh, thank God. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Don't get up. Oh, fuck you. Really?
He's not dead yet. And it broke. Okay. You're fucking shitty! Why? Why though? Can I stomp the hits? Can I stomp your hit? No! Fuck me. I did not want to, sh to waste that bullet. Honestly. I honestly did not want to waste that bullet. Where am I? Safety deposit room. Right. Of course, uh, there's another puzzle here. Storage locker terminal memo. It appears that the keypad to the locker's terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest that the person responsible for this miss find some spare keys and fix this right now. You know who you are, bastard. Who else fuck this up <laughs> this badly? Okay. Oh, come on. F two, oh, three. Right, so I need some extra keys to get all this good stuff that's lying around. Okay. But I want all the good stuff lying around. <laughs> and some asshole. Oh. Right. Oh, so to get to this shotgun, I need a key. Right. A key card. I really want a key card. Okay, where should I go? Okay, when I leave this room, I'm going to go left. And then, I'm, then I'm going to go left again, and, sc and then I'm going to go straight ahead. Fuck that guy. Oh god. Oh, I don't want to do this. But what can I do, honestly? <laughs> Is this even the right way to go? Okay, I'm there. Then I'm going to go into the dark room, and there's going to be stairs there. Wow, I didn't want to do this. And I'll probably die. This is nice. There's an herbs here. What's this? A wooden board! Oh! There's a typewriter. Medicinal benefits of herbs. Uh. Right. And let's see if there's some stuff to find. Oh! Gunpowder! I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, combine this. And we have some more ammo. This is really nice. I like this. And more bullets. We need bullets. We really, we we really need bullets. Oh, hello. We found a a red herb. Let's see. Let's combine this with this. We'll fully restore your health, that's really nice. Let's see what's down here. Oh, hello. There's a nail in this. Right. 
So I guess I have to use the wooden board on that uh, window. Can't really use these uh, things in the sink to it to do anything. Right. Okay. But this is a really good place to uh, stop the video. First, I'm going to just board up this this window. Now we are. That'll keep that asshole out of here and I'm just gonna go in here and save. Because that's a typewriter. So I'm just going to say thank you for watching me. If you like this video then please like, comment and subscribe and see you next time. Bye!